Tags in Notion are super helpful, allowing you to search for specific entry types in various ways. If you need to use tags to filter through and sort your data entries to make things easier to find, here's how to get it done. Tags work with Notion's databases and tables. To start, head over to notion.so and log into your account if you haven't already, or open Notion's desktop app. Head over to the database you want to add tags to. Upon creation, Notion's tables have a column for tags by default, but if you've deleted it or repurposed it, scroll over to the rightmost of your database and create a new column by clicking on the Add icon in the column title row. Name it Tags, mouse over its current property type, and select the Multi-Select property. Note that you can have multiple tag columns if needed. From here, you can create a tag for a row by clicking on its empty tag cell and typing in a tag you want to add, then tapping enter to create it. To apply your created tag to another row, click on its tag cell and select your tag on the window that appears. You can add multiple tags to a row by selecting another tag from this list or typing it and creating it from scratch. Any created tags will remain exclusive to its column. For example, if you've got a movie database, you can have one tagging column that tags a movie's genre, and a second tagging column that tags the year the movie came out. Any created genre tags won't show up as options in the year column unless you chose to add it in. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Notion and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.